refrain. Yo. Yo, yo, guys, it's Kirellis. Finally, we are back with the last part of the 20 by 20 house, and I've just done the interior, so I will just take you for a quick spin down the basement here. Oh, well, not the basement, but well, we'll start in the basement. As you can see here, uh, we just made a small bar area here, which is really small and tiny, like Frodo Baggins serving drinks, pretty cool. Uh, that's just because one of the subscribers told me, dude, do a, do a bar. And well, I thought, why not just do a small bar area. Up here on this floor, we have a kitchen, of course, with some double taps. We have a fridge with a dispenser. Let me just click the buttons. You can see, works pretty cool. Some crafting area, storage area, of course, furnaces and stuff like that. And of course, more storage area because storage areas are cool. Here on the upstairs, we have the bedroom, a fish tank, some day bed, like you can just lay down and relax. Of course, the bed with a TV. It's actually not a, not a wise, uh, not a flat screen TV this time, but well, hope you will still live with that. And as well, as uh, like an office area, is watching some Skyblock live, so live stream, I guess. And of course, a sitting area with some bookshelves next to that. So yeah, guys, this is a really simple interior design, so hopefully you will enjoy it. And I will now go and continue making the treehouse, which is actually on the same map here, which is just like, there we go, there's the treehouse. Looking pretty cool and nice. So guys, do enjoy. Take care yo, and bye. Yo guys, it's Kiralis. Welcome back to part four of the 20 by 20 house. And today we're gonna start here on the basement and make it, well, furnish some I guess. Uh, what I will do is build a bar down here uh, because some people tell me like dude build a bar well so let's build a bar here and see how that looks. Did you do did you do 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 a jukebox maybe in the bar you know jukebox are cool so let's see what do we have maybe just delete those for now like take the floor down because I think maybe we could make some bar stools or something something maybe actually we could use the new sandstone that's pretty cool like, where is it then? Oh my god, I'm totally... There we go, some holographic sandstone. Alright, so this will be the bar area. Delete that for now as well, and pick up some normal sandstone as well. And then just fill in this space. So we will be coming down, like, here somewhere. Like this. Let me just think. And we'll have a bar stools. Maybe just two of them. Like one here, one here. Yeah, that will work. And then just take this up. Well, actually, we can take this up whole way here. I guess. All right, some glowstone for the bar. And the bar will actually be doubled stone slabs, I guess. I, I don't know. I just like those. That actually looks pretty cool. Uh, so this is the beginning of the bar area. Uh, maybe just place some some more. S well, actually, I'm gonna delete this wall. Uh, maybe this one as well. No, let's just keep that for now. Uh, and place some more glowstone here on this side. Maybe a jukebox here. And some of the holographics thing is here. Damn, it's gonna be like Frodo bagging serving drinks. Hello, I'm for the baggings. All right, so let's go up. Don't need more of this then. Normal sandstone. I'm actually gonna intrude a bit on the behind area here and then just, well, even more. I think we are just on the edge here now, like on the bush edge. So I am s truly sorry about that, that we actually exceeded the area a bit there, but nothing that we can do about it now. So place some hieroglyphic thingies up back here. More glowstone. I don't know. Maybe that's this actually looks quite alright. I don't know. Some hieroglyphs here on the walls. Like here. And maybe. Let me just think. Maybe just here as well. Damn! Looking sweet. 
and good, I guess. That wasn't, was that, oh my god, my dogs. That wasn't a jukebox. But let me, if we place the jukebox here, and a hieroglyph here. Yeah, that looks better. So what we're gonna do now is take some, 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 some of the magical things here, like the brewing stand, and make it look like some party thingy. One here, one here. For our bar. In the ceiling, I was thinking, maybe just add some. Some more detail, I don't know if that's really needed, but it gives us, gives it some more character, so. All right, so let's just go. Oh shit, I forgot to fix that. So let's just put that there, and let me see one. Here, me, oops. And one here, like this, just to give it some more details for the bar area. That actually looks pretty cool. No. Let's just go without that. And this will be our bar. In this corner we will maybe place a f bush, flower, I don't know, call it what you want to call it, but I will call it a bush, but it's actually some leaves. Alright guys, does this like look like a bar with Frodo Baggins inside of it? Hello Frodo Baggins. Pretty cool. So let's head up in the kitchen area. Uh, whoa, there's actually a big kitchen, but I'm not sure what we're gonna do here. So let's pick up some st stuff. Sandstone, the new sandstone, hieroglyphic sandstone, and I will do a kitchen like in all over this corner here. So I will just make this like being in the kitchen. I guess it is. Maybe something like that. Let's keep that for now. Uh, so, for a kitchen we will use... Let me just see. We will use some... Of course, we will use that. Glowstone might be needed. We will use... Do -do 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 pistons. Pistons. We will use some dispenser. Some furnace. Some sink will be needed, of course. Some sink. Maybe some levers as well. Yeah, bucket of water, of course. So, let's go. We will put the sinks down first, and the sinks will be in this corner, maybe. Like overlooking the window, that will look pretty, pretty witty. Behind the sinks, I will actually take some iron blocks. Because, you know, we spill a lot in the kitchen, and we don't want to ruin the sandstone, so... Iron blocks like this. Put down the tabs, water here, and oh my god, didn't have creative mode on, so that pretty much sucked. So let's pick up one more bucket then and fill in the other one there. Okay, so that's done. Now let's see, next to the kitchen we will use, well, we will have a dishwasher because that can be cool. Next to that, place a dispenser, maybe some iron block, and that will be our fridge. So let's pick up an iron door. I'm totally lost in the new too many items because a lot of items has been added which I haven't been using. So button here and the door from above of course. So let's just fly up and put the door here. So let's just see if the dispenser works. Yeah it does. Pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. So double stone slabs. Like maybe one here. One here maybe. What I will do is maybe delete this here, delete that, place some, and I know we are actually on the border now because that's actually the fence outside, but well, hopefully you don't mind anyways. So let me just see, uh, do 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 stone slabs, the new cool stones, uh, sorry, sandstone slabs, and just place one here and one there and do 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 chest there we go now we have a chest area cool alright so 
let me just see maybe something like this. Delete that, maybe we can place our furnaces down here. And the chimney actually here. Maybe place oops, place one more here. Well, let's make a kitchen aisle. Like island, maybe oops. Here and here. Looks pretty cool actually. So let's make like if you come down from the basement you can go straight in the kitchen. Maybe one here, maybe one here as well. Just to keep the shape here of the kitchen going. And I will actually use a crafting table here because we, so we can craft in the kitchen. So crafting table here. Cool, I would say. And above that, let's place down some pistons which will look like cupboards. Something, something. So one, oops. Can we place them from like here maybe? Like here, here and there. All right. So now it goes for the table. Oh shit, there's actually not that much time place for, for a table here. But what I will do, actually, let's go crazy and place some bar stools like we did in the in the basement. And why? I don't know. It might look cool. Might not look cool. So. So let's see if we. Oh shit, there's actually. All right, so doesn't matter. Doesn't matter at all. There we go. So place one maybe here, and one here. I know this shape isn't really that nice, but well, we don't really have that much room to work with. Glowstone. Glowstone was used in the basement as well. So let's. Oops. Well, that was really unnecessary because that won't be seen anyways. But still. All right. So pretty cool. There we go. That's a small looking kitchen bar disc area. Damn, the kitchen is sort of starting to look nice actually. Alright, so here, what can we place here? A bush maybe? Or leaves as some would say. Looks pretty nice. And I will actually maybe use poo 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 dirt, dirt block there. And maybe some flowers. I hardly never use flowers, and I don't know why actually. Place that here. Some flower on top. Look at that pretty thing. Looks pretty cool actually. So that kitchen is mainly done. I don't know if we should actually add more things to it because otherwise it may be just gonna look too cramped. Well, we need a coffee pot or something. We're gonna use the brew stand for that. Brew, 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 brew stand. All right, so let's just place that in a corner here. There we go. There's a coffee maker, because we need coffee. Coffee's good for you. Well, it's not actually that good, but well, you, if you're hooked, you're hooked. So place a bush here as well. On this side, maybe we can actually, let's see, I think, is that? No. So what we're gonna do here is actually take the wooden slabs and then just place a wooden slab of the new kind. Like here. And that will allow us to have some bibibu. That will allow us to have the chests here like free in height because storage area, well, we always need a lot of storage area. Maybe storage here. Yeah, that could work. And uh, below that, maybe some bookshelves. I don't know. You pick, you choose. I don't know. Bookshelves. Let's go for bookshelves. See how that looks. Yeah, that could work pretty nice. So guys, this is actually the most thing things done here in the kitchen. We don't really need that much more to add here. Yeah, let's go just ahead. Uh, maybe some storage area here as well. So glowstone. And maybe some lever, like here, we, which we can hang our clothes. Maybe one here, one here, as well. Yeah, cool. All right, upstairs. Boo 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 bo
beds. The first thing I usually place when I build interiors is the bed, because well, they are kind of the most important things in a bedroom. So I'm going to place them here or maybe here. No creative mode. Just take out the bed here. Pooh. Where is the bed? There are the beds. So place a bed here and here. A bookshelf on each side. Slab, not that type of slab. The normal wooden slab. And maybe just cover this up like that. Some light. Oh shit, I think we just destroyed the outside area. So what I will do, I'm just gonna go outside and repair that with some slabs. So let's just jump up and fly up. Whoa, this really sucks. So let's just that kind of fixed that problem. So let's head on in. All right, so that's the bed, and I will just make an old school TV like in front of the bed because. TVs in bedrooms are cool, even though you shouldn't maybe use them that much because you get stuck quite easy in the bedroom with a TV, but well, you know, still gonna have one. So let's just cycle painting, that's a pretty nice and decent painting. Uh, let me just see where are the trapdoors, there we go, trapdoor here. And let's just place trapdoors all around here. Alright, pretty cool. So, should we add more things to the bedroom? No, maybe just add some works because of slabs. Storage area, so yeah, I'm gonna place the storage area there. And you know, I love the bushes here, or the leaves thingies. Pretty cool. So let's see, what more can we add? A, a working area, uh, maybe here, back here, or maybe actually here. That's gonna be free and weird, so let's do that. And what I will do is actually use the new slabs here. I know it doesn't really affect us that much because we will still have like a, a sitting area in front of it, but from the outside I think it will actually look like a desk or something. So I'm just gonna scroll around, there we go. looking pretty. Uh, painting maybe just in front of that, so there we go. It's looking on some skyblock live video joystick. Pew pew! And uh, good. I know I've been watching Bruce Almighty, it went on the TV like a couple of days ago and I just can't yet get that good out of my head. So I'm stuck with good. There we go. That will work perfectly. Uh, maybe some more signs, like a sign maybe behind the, the whole thing here. And that was actually a log. There we go. That's our working area. In this corner, maybe just a bookshelf. And the thing is just to use all the space we have here. Maybe it will look a bit cramped, but well, let's try it out anyways. Like a sitting chair where we can sit, relax, and we'll read our books. So I'm just gonna pick up the signs here. I'm just gonna find the signs. There we go, there's the sign. Some R armrests on this side and armrests on that side. Cool. Doo -doo, doo -doo. Pretty nice. So what more can we add here? It's actually getting pretty filled up here. Uh, I will actually do an aquarium and I'm gonna use the light wood here. Some ice and some slabs. So let's see. Maybe one, two, three here. So we still have pretty much space to go enter the bedroom. And that will be like a room divider for us. All right, guys. Starting to take shape back here. I don't know. Maybe a more sitting area here. 
because seating areas are a space filler. There we go. This can actually maybe be like a day bed or something. Like you can just lay down here and relax. Yeah. On this wall, jukebox. We're gonna do a jukebox with a storage area above. Because we can. So let me see, where's the jukebox? There's a jukebox and some poo -poo -poo -poo. trap doors. So trap door will go above the storage area here, I guess. Like this something. Oops. Oh my god. There we go. Guys, I don't know. I think we are pretty much done. Can we f squeeze in more here? Yeah, we can. Look at this space. Let's place a bush there. Because we can. But that will actually solve the problem for us. As you can see, the bedroom and we have a TV area, we have a working area, some sitting area here, some day bed here, which overlooks actually a pool outside. Pretty cool. Uh, we come down here, we have the thing here, the storage, the kitchen is mostly done, a pretty small kitchen in many ways, but still. We have a bar area, a TV area, and a big storage area here with some furnaces and crafting tables and stuff. So, 20 by 20 house, guys, it's done. So I hope you enjoy this. I will now actually continue on the tree house, which is just built like over there, which is actually the same map, so I will continue on that one. But, well, I hope you enjoy. And we'll see you in the next video, guys. Take care and goodbye.